I've been looking at every store that I go to for the mini brands books and I think I just went to Walmart at the perfect time because it looked like they had recently restocked stuff and mini brands books were there so I got two of them. I've seen some of the options and some of my favorite book series have mini versions in the mini brands books so let's see what I get. I'm also really glad to see that this is recycled plastic. So we have one, two, three, four. This one feels really big. Ooh, and there's a checklist. I love me a good checklist. There's the common ones. There's rare, ultra rare, luxury, iconic, and legendary. I'm gonna open the big one first because I don't know what could be this big. It's a little shelf for the books. They all come with little shelves. I've seen a few unboxings of these, not a ton. Bam, there is the bookshelf. Now, this one is a book for sure. So I haven't heard of this one before. It says Holiday Inn by James Howe. I'll do a close up view of this one in one sec. Wow, they really can get those words all on there. That is impressive. Next one. Mm, I got one of the ones that I didn't want, so I'm obviously gonna like keep it, but there's one author on this list that I didn't want any of her books. Yeah, and she has two books on here. But also, it doesn't seem to like fit with the theme of the other ones because most of the books on here are like kids, middle grade, and young adult books. There's my cat. I got a Colleen Hoover one. I'm just not a fan of her as an author or as a person. But that is okay. And one more. I'm very hopeful this will be a good one. Thinking that it might be. Oh. I mean, it's a pretty one. It's just a book that I haven't read. But that's fine. Black Beauty. And this is Hardback. I got an ultra rare, a rare, and a common. Let's open up the second one and see what I get. Opening the mini brands is ruining my nail polish, but that's fine. Feels like we have another shelf, and then feels like three books. Let's do the shelf first. Someone with more knowledge about mini brands should let me know if you get a shelf with each mini brands books. So I did that, and then I have to figure out how to stack them. I think you take the top off, and then you take the bottom pegs off. And then, bam, got my shelf that is now two layers. Let's open the books and see what I get. The first one is Babysitter's Little Sister. I was never into the Babysitter's Club. It was just one of those series that I never got into. I think it may have also skipped my generation a little bit or like my specific age group because nobody else that I knew really read those books. People who read them were always like older or younger. There wasn't many like of my age reading them, at least in my area. Next one. What is this? Is this a bookmark? Okay, so here's the bookmark that I got. I'll obviously flip the camera around to show you what the bookmark looks like. I got Alice's Adventures in Wonderland, which I'm very happy to have this one. So the thing about me and Alice's Adventures in Wonderland is that this book is very nostalgic for me. Reading it back as an adult, I'm not a very big fan of it, but when I was a kid, I was obsessed with this, so it's very nostalgic to have that. So I'm very happy to have Alice's Adventure in Wonderland. I think I might already see what this one is. Yep, I got another one that was from the author that I didn't want any of her books. It starts with us. So for this one I got an ultra rare, a rare, and a common as well. Plus the bookmark. So yeah, that was really fun and I might be getting more of these because I really especially want to collect the three Miss Peregrine's books that are on here. Those are like the ones that I most want. I will die happy if I get those three so I need obviously the first book and Hollow City and Library of Souls so I'm very hopeful that I can get those in future ones if I can find more of them because it was so hard to find any of them in stores. 